Hi, I'm Sherry Martin. Tonight on Heart of the Home, I'm so honored. I want my guest to introduce himself to you. Hello, I'm uh, Sergeant Major Tony Gate in the United States Army. Tony lives in Tate, Georgia, and Tony and I spent last Easter together, but it was an email, wasn't it? Yeah. Email, yeah. you were in Baghdad, That's you correct. attended a sunrise service in Baghdad while we were here attending church. Um, you're home, you're safe, I'm so grateful. Communicating with you was wonderful because I knew when the guys were coming home, we were placing yellow ribbons for your um, group of fellows that came home. When did 48th Brigade? 48th Brigade, yes. 48th Brigade um, safely came home. I was so pleased. I was so pleased with the neighborhood. Everybody turned out and everybody supported you. And it was such a pleasure to know that we knew, you know, when you were coming, when the guys were going to be there. It was easy to coordinate because we could email across the world. We could email. So... It was wonderful. It was one of the most special days of my life. I guarantee uh, and I and it was for Jasper. It was for Jasper. Thank you. Um, he's here for Easter, and we're going to share a recipe that my adopted mama, Lucy Van Doren, created. It's called Nana's Nest. The ingredients for this recipe are a um, flour tortilla shell, and I must tell you, you can't use the fat free. You need the fat. So. And then um, with that, we um, will fry that, then cinnamon, sugar, ice cream. We're going to decorate it with coconut that we're going to dye green that will look like grass. Okay. That'll be your job. <laughs> the topping ingredients are fresh pineapple, kiwi, strawberries. And do I get to be the general in this episode? Can I be your hey, boss? You're in charge. Oh, I'm in charge. I, I'm I never in charge. Well. Oh, good, good. We're starting with a tortilla shell. We're going to fold it in half. The pattern is of star because when this comes out, it actually looks like a jagged edge that an egg would come out of when an egg is hatched. All right. And you're going to cut this for me. Boy, you mind good. I like men who take orders. I bet your wife likes that too. Okay. There you I'm go. The pattern. There you go. There you go. Just hold it down till it cooks. How, long, how do I know how when it's done? Just takes about probably 30 to 45 seconds. Okay. So now we're going to take it out with this appliance. There you go, so you can drain the grease. Cool. That's pretty good. I think you're hired. <laughs> Sit it down there. Right. Now, we've taken our hot nest, and we are going to cover it in cinnamon and sugar. That was quick, huh? You did a good job. You did a good job. Now, we're going to make grass. We're going to make right. coconut grass. Now, I want you to put me about three drops of green food coloring in there. Right. We're going to start with about three drops. Okay, our grass is done. We're going to put a little bit of grass around the nest, and then we'll put a little bit on top of it. But we are going to start with a scoop of peach ice cream. Now, your job is to garnish this, and I want you okay. to just be creative. I'm not going to fuss. I don't care how you do it. I don't care what you do. You just do what you think you would like. Pineapple, kiwi, strawberries. Tony, we're almost finished. What does a nest need? Well, you got bird eggs, but no birds. So I it? see a bird. A peep. Wow. All right. There you go. There you go. Guys, this has been, honestly, my favorite heart of the home, my best guest. I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of what you do for a living. Thank you so much for everything you do for Thank our country. Um, Y'all keep in touch. Email your soldiers. Remember, they're over there fighting for us. Keep in touch with them. Thank you again. Thanks. Love you.